Well, God bless you. God keep you. I'm Pastor Mervyn January of Save to Serve Ministries, inviting you out to our Sunday morning worship service at 10 o'clock a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Quick reminder, by faith, we're going to be returning to our physical building location on March the 6th. 2022 and we're going to be seeking prayer warriors we're going to be seeking musicians you know other ministry volunteers i'm looking around because <laughs> we need a lot <laughs> that's right march the 6 2022 by faith we're going to return back to our physical building location but if you want to join with us before then you're always welcome to join with us here online and of course there are multiple ways that you can join us on kingdom purpose tv app and if you download that app, then you'll have access to all of our television broadcasts each and every week. And all you need is a Roku TV, an Amazon Fire Stick TV, an Android phone, or an Apple phone. If you don't have any of those items, but say, hey, I've got the internet, then you can still see our television broadcast by joining us on our website, savedandserving.org, and then selecting the broadcast of your choice. Of course, our home team is savedandserving.org, our ministry website. You can always view our live streams there, or you can choose the social media platform that is to your liking. Our mantra is we're reaching the people where they are. That's right. We're going to come to wherever you are and make sure that the word is being presented and being offered because before the second coming of Christ, the Bible simply instructs us that the word must be preached around the world. That's biblical which leads me into this week's topic. This week, we're gonna be focusing on a topic entitled Born to Win. This is part two of a three-part series that God has given me. This will be what I call the introduction of the mystery of the red heifer that is sacrificed as a sign of the second coming of Jesus Christ. However, next week, we're gonna discuss in detail several unanswered questions such as what is the second coming of Christ? And is the second coming the same as the rapture? Or are these two different events? Also, what are the differences between Jesus's first coming and Jesus's second coming? And what exactly is going to happen at the second coming of Jesus Christ? Once again, I'm Pastor Mervyn January, asking you to join us for our weekly worship this Sunday at 10 o'clock a.m. Treat yourself, don't cheat yourself. Hallelujah. God bless you. And until we see you again, may the Lord increase your faith and may he bless you real good.